haven't even had a chance to really look at the stat sheet yet, but I know these two had double doubles, so um, I did get to see that. But just really proud of our team's effort today. Finally, we got some shots to go down. So um, I think that that's where we've really been struggling with our confidence and. As a coach, you, you always want it to start on the defensive end, but sometimes that's just not how it is for players. And the reality of it is when you hit shots, you get more confident. And um, I told these guys in the locker room, we've got to learn now how to play with a lead. We haven't had many leads this year. And so um, now is a new challenge, just like every day is. You've got to learn how to play with a lead and not let teams come back on you. And, um, but just we, we went 24 for 29 from the free throw line, shot 82%, 50% from the floor, 36% from the three-point line. So um, just really happy for our kid. four people in double figures. I mean, Laura goes down and gets hurt. We basically, I mean, we had to play with six players, really. Um, so just happy for the kids, and hopefully this gives us some confidence as we go into getting a couple days off and then have to play Wright State next week. I think it just feels good. Um, you know, the, last, the first three games were kind of tough for us, but I think it's good that we all stay positive and push through it. So I think it does, it's just a really good feeling right now. Yeah, especially coming off those two road, road games against Green Bay and Milwaukee, obviously the two best teams in the Horizon League. Um, and then a tough loss against Cleveland State, but then now getting this win, we can now look past that and move, move forward. So it was a good win.